And morning, Jerry. Morning, Stephen. I'm going to be talking to some people today from the uh, Macmillan Cancer, and uh, obviously uh, I'm uh, doing this marathon thing on November 6th oh, for oh. Action Cancer. Oh, really? You're just... uh, uh, you may well laugh. I remember a certain <coughs> see, a TV series. Your problem is I know your trainer, <laughs> who's been telling me that you haven't really turned up. No, I'll tell you what's happened. You see, I have been ill this last three, four weeks. Oh, have uh, you? What's you, been wrong? You can hear in my voice. Warts. Uh, whilst, whilst I was off on the holidays, I got some kind of uh, virus. Uh, Warts. No, it was malaria. No, something w- which was quite odd, and I wasn't able to do any training for like three, four weeks. Right. And I'm still, I'm still not That's started funny. yet. That's funny, because <clears throat> your, your personal trainers told me you haven't turned up for months. But I haven't been here for a month. The last time I went up with him, he nearly killed me. Yes. And I told him that I had a little way to go, and, and that I was going to really concentrate during my holidays, and I was going to train every day. Mm-hmm. But then as soon as I went on my holidays, I got ill. Jerry, uh, yes. you're a disgrace. Oh, 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 excuse me. You have let more than the, the this initiative no. down. You have let the BBC down. No, but hold on a second. You talk about letting the BBC down. I seem to remember a series called uh, Going the Distance, <laughs> where Stephen Nolan promised to run a marathon yes. and hardly got out of his and I, bed. And I seem to remember a man saying that was a disgrace. Sorry, uh, you had, your, you had your radio voice on that day. You said that was a disgrace. Disgrace. Now listen, disgrace. I'm, still, I'm still doing the marathon. All right. Oh, don't, don't you be saying that no, I'm not doing it. I'm no, still doing it. How can saying, you do it with my, no my, my training. training? My training has had a, a setback. What are you going to do? Go run in a golf buggy? Don't you be sarcastic. I have got another five weeks to kind of, you know, get myself into... Well, well I, I wasn't too therefore, bad. Therefore, the question is this. I'll just what? treat you like anybody else. Go on. When are you going <laughs> to the gym? I'm... Make a commitment gym. today. I was, I was in the gym yesterday. With your personal trainer. No, I'm not going with him. He's too hard on me. All right, I see. He's too, he was too hard on you. He said the, the best. He said the only thing he ever did with you, you went out for a walk and then never came back. <laughs> Isn't that true? <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Go away. That's true. I know it is. He told me all about you. He said you're a disgrace. Well, he walked me around the Malone Road. Yeah, I know, people were talking. So those people don't pay their milk bills. <laughs> hey, what does this remind you of? <laughs> what? The, the 70s? Ha, 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 ha.